How's it going, YouTube? I just want to give a quick update about the 189, uh, the mod I did, and how I got it to go a lot faster. Uh, first of all, I want to say I've been busy. I've been trying to, wanted to do some videos, but I've been busy with work. We're in the middle of turnaround season, so it got pretty hectic. I actually get, did get to go ride last weekend, and the whole plan was to make an update video on the track of the bike. Uh, I want to get a mic for my GoPro so I can talk, start doing vlogs, vlogs, whatever you want to call it, uh, see how that goes. But um, first of all, I was on this bike and I was hitting a 30 foot table and, and as I was coming off the lip of it, the brake line decides it wants to get caught in the front brake rotor. So that didn't end too well, it kind of busted up my, my lip a little bit. I had a helmet on, all my protective gear, blah, 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 yeah, yeah. Uh, what the mod I did was I took the brake lever and clutch lever from the 160 and put it on here. I just like them better because they're like wannabe breakaways and they look cooler. And I think I took away about 10 or 15 pounds off the bike because you know these things are already tanked. So any less weight is a win-win situation. And I also think I added about three or four horsepower. Um, my whole shot reaction time is like pretty impressive right now with these new clutch lever and brake lever but anyways uh next thing i want to do is i talked to a couple people about it was the graphics i want to put more better graphics on it because these are kind of uh it's a good bike no problems i locked tight everything i could uh the only thing i came loose that i caught was right here in the brake lever it got a little loose but i tightened it just in time uh other than that this bike is a very solid bike once it's running. I do have the bog problem too. Uh, let me try to kick it. I only kicked this bike like twice since I had it because the electric start is perfect for lazy people like me. Uh, the bike is semi warm, so let's see. Yeah, sometimes it is a little stubborn to start. It has real good back pressure. I can say that. Uh, like I said, the bike is semi-warm. I never rev it up when it's cold because it's bad things from my understanding can happen. But you're a little rev. Yeah, hold on. Once it's warmed up, the bike is a beast. No vlogging, no none of this, none of that, you know. And I also did accidentally leave the, the, the fuel line on too over the weekend. Oh, the first thing that broke on this bike was right here, the fuel filter. Uh, this is a different fuel filter from Cycle Gear. Cause the plastic ones that, had, that they had on there was cheap and elite. Let all my free tank of gas out. I was kind of pissed, but it's a quick fix. Uh, give it a couple revs. You can hear the bog. But it gets a lot better once it's fully really warm. Yeah, one of these days when I have time to just sit there and take it apart and fix the jetting issue and all that, I'll do it. But as of right now, I just want to ride it. It's no problem. I hope I didn't bore y'all. Uh, I do plan on going riding tomorrow or day after tomorrow, which is Saturday or Sunday. Get a better on the track video and see how it does. Oh, uh, the way I did make it faster was I stopped being weak and I started opening the throttle up more often. It, it, it made it a lot faster. Uh, that's about it. All right. Any questions or concerns or anything, feel free to ask. Like, dislike, subscribe, unsubscribe. Peace.